mm, this day. What's up, guys? We're out here at the favorite spot again. Brown Road, go Brown. Let's get out here and throw some red crank baits and some swim baits and some Texas Red Cross and see what we find. That's a snag. No way around that. No, it's not. Oh, and he came off. Got one. Son of a... <laughs> this day. There he goes. That's a little one. Mom, 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 mom. He's still on there. Yeah, he is. Right. Vegetable stew with beef, self cooking. Put the pouch into the bag. Staying for three to five minutes. Probably got another hour and a half to two hours of fishing left in me. Oh my. So that's pretty cool, right? I know utensils needed. It's like a heat pouch. Well, you can feel the heat from that. So check it out, too. I hope they use that pretty good, but just 170 calories, one serving per container. That's really good. Oh, it's hot. It's a small serving. I can see why it's a single serving.
Okay. Okay. Let's get you a gander here. It looks like beef stew. I know it's kind of dark out here. I hope it shows up well on the GoPro because, you know, GoPro and dark doesn't go well together. But yeah, it looks like a, a beef stew. Very nice. A bit of salt and pepper since it came with it. I normally don't salt and pepper the food, just hot sauce it. If it came with it, we'll do it. Vegetable beef stew. I taste like beef stew you'd have at home from like a can, like not mama's, but like what you get from like a, you know, little carb loaded, calorie loaded can of beef stew. Or a quarter mile, I guess, is what, what it is. Tastes like that. The vegetable beef stew from Oatmeal. I would do it again. This is a fat guy thing to say, but I would definitely need like another one of these pouches. So like it, it was only like halfway filled up anyway. Super small serving. I'm a big guy. If you were trying to survive out there, then yeah, it, it would do just fine. But for me trying to eat for the joy of eating, double portion would be about right. It is good though. Probably a seven. Cool that you could cook with just water. I would totally do it again. All right, guys, headed home on my last battery. My outro has got to be quick. Hey, man, it was a tough day out there. Like, the bass didn't want to bite. I got one bite that came off underwater, one that jumped up out of the water and shook the hook. Uh, just a tough day. It, luckily for the bluegills and the one-inch gopal live minnows, uh, I at least pulled some fish in the boat, a couple of decent bluegill, a couple of really small panfish. I expected more bass. I'm going to go to Broadway Lake tomorrow. I'm going to try somewhere different. Um, I may just be in that zombie mode where I'm doing the same thing over and over again and it's just not working. So threw out everything I knew today though and it was just tough. Just tough. I I, I was excited last night guys. I, I thought when I went to sleep I'm like tomorrow's gonna be one of those days. I'm gonna go out there and pull in some decent fish. You know most of them will be around two pounds or bigger and unfortunately no. That's fishing right? Like it is what it is guys. We'll catch some big ones soon. It's just a matter of time. We're doing everything right. Uh, I've got my camping trip coming up and that's gonna be fun. Um, I appreciate y'all coming along for the ride as always. 